That was, um, bad. But I can now flick the switch. And we're going this way. Going down. <laughs> Into the ventilation shafts. Uh, that's a dead end. Sounds like we're not the only thing down here. Welcome to Black Mesa. And there's a hill thing, which is useful. And a terminal and a pluggy in thing. Right, let's plug in thing and figure out what the hell's going on. Huh? Wait, this isn't Oh no! Wow well, got to the Dunbat before we did, am I right? Didn't see that coming. Well, talking. That's rarely a good sign. Was our best shot. I was really banking on this to work. Come on, we can't quit now. There's got to be another way. How do you think you did it? How did the team get the Ark down the abyss in the first place? Walk. If they didn't use the Dunbat, the only other way would be the climber in Omicron. It's like an elevator which supposedly reaches all the way down into the abyss. Okay, so we do that. We go to Omicron and take the elevator. Yeah. Okay. Sure. We'll just head over to Omicron and hope there's a power suit that fits you. You know, so you don't implode while in the abyss. <laughs> that does sound useful. Alright, let's go then. Wait, what is this place? Seems to be a lot of information on the art here. There's a prototype and everything. Okay. Let's start it up. I want to see how it works. Maybe we can figure out how to get on the Ark. You didn't know how to get us on? How difficult could it be? Ooh, shiny words, pictures. Wow, that's so cool. It's the whole gang. A crew photo? Really? Who are you saving this for? The world was dead. Thanks, Simon. I thought being an asshole wasn't invented until the 22nd century. Now I know better. Yep, yeah, I'm guessing uh, power suit is going to be the next thing we do. That's Phi, all right. Quick stop at Omicron, then Tau, then Phi. Let's do it. Can I do anything with this? I can. Uh, where do I plug it in? The arc doesn't even look that bulky. This is going to be easy. You haven't heard of the concept of jinxing, have you? 
Sorry, I forgot your people were superstitious. Maybe I have to bring the Ark back here? Okay, computer terminal. See what we got. Uh, a questionnaire. Recently I've decided the Ark project would become Pathos 2 last official commitment. Uh, I think the art project is the most logical step towards saving mankind and we should spend as much time and resources. Absolutely. I strongly agree on that. Uh, to embark on passion needs to be flushed with electromagnetism using a pilot seat. These scanning sessions are known to cause nausea and headaches sometimes up to three days. I think terrible physical discomfort. Oh, start again with words. I think temporary physical discomfort, no matter how severe, is a small price to pay to save mankind. Uh, yeah, absolutely. Um, the Ark is built to fit a Ranger MK7 uh, probe, meaning it can be shot into space with the Omega Space Gun, which is that thing underwater that they mentioned earlier. It's all coming together. Technically survive for thousands of years. I think the Ark should leave Earth behind and be launched into space. Absolutely. Uh, the digitalization of humanity is an opportunity to make quantum leap in our own evolution. Uh, people inside the Ark will be out of necessity to be generated from existing genetic code, but could be altered to allow for cosmetic changes, ease aging, and even prevent death. Well, technically you're a code, so you're not going to die unless someone deletes you. Um, we're at risk of losing our humanity, we rid ourselves of disease and our mortality. Um... No, I think we still have humanity. I think we're all still going to be assholes. So I disagree with that. There are only 58 people left alive to be stored inside the Ark. That's not many. Uh, a way to diversify and expand the population would be to introduce artificial intelligence that would in every way appear to be human or with childlike and naive sensibilities. As we continue to explore the nature of intelligence, we may find a way to make sure we're smarter in the future. Uh, I think even inferior groups would benefit our society. I strongly disagree. I think messing around with AI is only going to lead to bad things happening, like what's just happened. Uh, this is how your colleagues voted. Arc approval, everyone agreed. Eternity amongst the stars, everyone pretty much agreed. Inferior companions, everyone strongly disagreed. Pain for gain, strongly agreed. Uh, so I pretty much kept with everybody. Yeah. Pretty much what everyone else said. Okay, I'll just knock that chair over. Out the way, chair. Silly chair. Okay, well. Ooh, I can plug this in. So that's the thing. Oh, this is an arc thing. Okay, so nearly half the memory has been corrupted. That's bad. Okay, so uh, let's see, what don't we need? Well, we don't need a boat. Or a chair. Or a river. Or a lake. So we can get rid of do we need clouds? Or really not. Or a sun. Or foliage. Or a dirt road. We don't even need forest. Yeah, just some basic stuff. Yep, 
Okay, well I've done it. I've reduced the loads. Why can't I click next? Okay, let's just turn everything off. Nope, that doesn't seem to do anything either. Okay, so the base requires... Oh, it's a puzzle. So now I need to put light and water in. Uh, so I need to have uh, a lake. And now we're overloaded. So we need the rigid and the soft and the buoyancy. Now we need some light. So we need some heat and some dynamics. We need some advanced and now we need interface scan and that. And now we're overloaded. Okay, so let's not use the sun, let's try the moon. And instead of a lake, let's try a river. So we've got fluid, rigid, and now we need that. Yes, there we go. So we're going to do it on a river in the moon. Try loading a dummy scan. It shouldn't be that difficult. I just want to make sure I understand how the scan data is formulated before we start messing around with the real arc. Okay. Run the simulation and then hit pause while the code is running. It'll give me a cross section of the process. Okay, so go with dummy. And then we start the simulation and then we pause. You need to pause while the dummy is loaded, otherwise I can't know if it's working or not. Try pausing it when the dummy is loaded. Oh, I have to hit. No, try again. The dummy needs to be loaded when you pause. Ah, oh, there we go. We can slow it down. There we go. Yes, of course. So precise. So perfect. Nothing like admiring your own work. What? Oh, right. So now we know how to get on the Ark, right? Kind of. What? It's just I don't really know what you are. Maybe there's a way to plug you in, or maybe scan somehow. We need to figure this out before we leave. Okay, so are we done? Take a look around the room. Must be something here that can help us. Okay, maybe this? What's this thing? That's just a compound examiner. Coster uses it to investigate structural integrity in payload frameworks. Of course. Could you fit inside it? If I knew what you were made of, it would be a hell of a lot easier to figure out how to get on the ark. Let me try. A tight fit. Can you reach the on switch? Yep, it's the big button right in front of me. 
should I be worried about radiation? I think we're beyond that. Interesting. You seem to be one with the diving suit you're wearing. Everything's meshed together. How's that gonna work with the suit we're picking up at Omicron? Um, I think they're bigger. You should be able to wear them both. Imogen? Who's that? It looks like the basis for your body is one of my old colleagues. A standard cortex chip for robots, including the data reader and the ocu torch, has just been forced through the skull. What? Structure gel has fused the whole construction together. Amazing stuff. No, 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 no. Hold on. Back up. I'm one of your old colleagues? Well, your body is. Imogen Reed. That's disgusting. Hey, don't say that. She was my... She was nice to me. Never! The cortex chip is good news. That means we can transfer your mind to the Ark with a pilot seat. Kath, I'm half a dead person. Yes, it makes sense. Think about it. All those simplistic minds we've run into? Just reviving a dead person doesn't seem to work that well. A robot body seems to make people a bit unreliable. You are the best of both worlds. A sound mind and a sound body. Okay, so I'm not actually technically a robot. I am a AI consciousness inside a dead body. Are we done here? Can we go to Omicron and get my new suit man? Yeah, we should get going. It's reassuring to know. Want to bring this arc as a backup? No, that wouldn't work. This is just a prototype. Good. I prefer to travel light. Let's go. Don't forget to take me with you. I wonder if you can actually forget to bring it along. I guess we're going this way. Off we go.